Hey what's up guys it's Dolphic here, today I'm going to be showing you the battle cat secrets. So first you want to wait for an hour because the cat battle spawns every hour. And then you want to go to MJ's house, the squires need to be MJ first and you should already know what this is. And then go to MJ's dog house, you should now see a cat face inside it. Have to click it. You should hear a cat sound. And this spawns right here. And cat battle love 80 plus. Get cat key 20,000 gold. 20,500 XP. Also, this D spawns in 5 minutes, so you want to be pretty quick. This fight is pretty easy, I think. Yeah, I just one-shotted it. Now, this boss drops the cat key, which is used to access the battle cat secrets, or at least the second half of it. And also, there's a little hidden message here. I have no idea what it means. So, we're gonna go into Hippo first. Let me equip my Tails Blade first. The boss only spawns when you attack the cat base, by the way, so... And you have to kill the boss to attack the cat base. Because if you just attack the, the cat base while the boss is still here, then the cat base will just keep healing infinitely. Also, you should be careful, because if you don't have enough DPS, then these minions can overrun you, or overwhelm you. Now, defeating Hippo and its cat base will award you the Axe Cat's Axe, which does 20,000 damage at max love. It's not that great of a weapon, because it doesn't even multi-hit, and it doesn't have any other special abilities, but it's a decent weapon, I guess. Now for the crazed one, I recommend buying twin fingers because they really help in battle because you're going to need to heal a lot. This is my loadout, Insanity Soul, Tails Blade, and Shadow Shell. You don't have to use the exact loadout I use, but this one really worked well for me. And this is only for solo loadouts. If you're doing it with a raid, then you do you. Here I'm taking damage so that I can charge up my Insanity Soul because the more damage you take, the more heals you get. I forgot to mention this, but I'm actually maxing out my damage boost to be safe. Now I'm waiting for the right time to strike. You can also kill all the minions because they can be a nuisance if you're fighting the crazed cat. The spawn limit for the doge darks is 23 by the way. Now here comes the crazed cat. This only spawns when you attack the cat base, by the way. It has a whopping 40 million health, so that's absolutely insane. Also, make sure you don't get hit by this purple explosion, because it does a lot of damage. Don't forget to heal. Also, don't forget to use the Shadow Shell's ability if you're in a tight spot. Now the crazed one drops Jamira Cat's shirt, which is uh, the armor that gives the most HP in the game currently. It gives more health based on your level, which is pretty good. Look at my HP, that's a lot. It also gives you this nice shirt. Again with that message, I have no idea what it means. You can get the crazed cat's soul at MJ's shop for 6 fragments, 100 million gold, and 20 resets. It's a pretty good soul and it increases in damage every time you get hit and has 12 second cooldown. It does 120,000 damage by default at max low. Next hit. Final hit. Well anyways, bye and thanks for watching.